In our time of social distancing, many people who live in nursing homes are feeling especially lonely because they can't have visitors. One way to help them, a pet, a robotic pet. Digital reporter Lexley Hazlett shows us how it works. A dog that barks and a cat that meows, but it's not a real animal, it's a robotic pet. But it could make a world of a difference for someone who is mostly alone in the pandemic. You know, people are requesting them all the time because their, their family cannot visit them. If they're in assisted living, if they're in a hospital, uh, they're not allowed in. And uh, so this is a, this is a connection uh, that they can have. Bruce Barnett is the CEO of Healthcare Products, LLC, for the Alzheimer's store. Now, hundreds of products on their website help people of older age or those who have memory loss. But why robotic pets? I know one of my friends visited her mother the other day and all she could do was wave to her from outside the window. It, it gives somebody a connection and, and, that's what, and that's what they really need, especially when they're so alone, especially with Corbin when no one can even visit them. And UTSA biology professor George Perry says especially in a time of social distancing, having that sense of touch can really make a difference. They could fill in a void, especially uh, during the COVID, where people do not have the chance of hugging or um, all of those tactile things that are so critical for all people, whether you're old or not old. And especially people with Alzheimer's, who Perry says make up more than a quarter of COVID patients who have passed away. It gives them something to not feel so alone in a time of isolation. The Alzheimer's store sells them for a little over $100 each, and they ship across the world. So, would you get one? This were my, um, you know, my parent, and they were restricted in who they could visit and didn't have a pet. Uh, I would think of doing this. Lexi Hazlett, Kins 5 Eyewitness News.